First of all, let's introduce the relevant background of this paper. What is betweenness centrality? Betweenness centrality is a metric used to measure the importance of vertices in the network. It calculates the betweenness centrality value by counting the shortest path through the vertices. Second, there are important differences between general graphs and temporal graphs. There is no timestamp on the edge of the general graph, and there is only one edge in the pair of vertices. There can be multiple temporal edges with different timestamps on the vertices of a temporal graph. In addition to the most commonly used shortest temporal path, there are many other optimal path types on the temporal graph, such as the fastest temporal path and the earliest temporal path. Third, what are the application scenarios? Betweenness centrality is widely used in epidemiological research, information dissemination, brain disease research, and so on. In epidemiological research, for example, betweenness centrality is critical for identifying superspreaders to control the spread of infectious diseases. There are difficulties. 1. In the general graph, the calculation method of intermediate centrality is mainly designed according to the Brandis algorithm. The key theory of the Brandis algorithm is that the subpath of the shortest path is still the shortest path, that is, the optimal substructure. Therefore, the theory and method of betweenness centrality calculation in the general graph are no longer applicable to temporal graph. 2. There are various types of temporal paths, such as shortest temporal path, fastest temporal path and earliest temporal path, which are difficult to be uniformly processed. 3. The exact algorithm needs to count the number of optimal temporal paths between each pair of vertices, so the time complexity is high. To tackle the above difficulties, our intuition is to transfer the temporal graph into a time instance graph, and we derive a new recursive temporal dependency formulation and present an exact algorithm ETBC to compute the temporal betweenness centrality values. To reduce the scale of the time instance graph and thus speed up the computation, we further design a lossless compression method that compresses the time instance graph with equivalent vertices and edges, and then propose an optimized calculation theory and the optimized algorithm OTBC. In addition, to handle massive graphs, we propose an approximate method ATBC. The general idea of ATBC is to utilize the sampling method, which considers only a subset of vertices or temporal paths. Thanks for listening.